post so it has been so long since i've posted anything on here um but i've done my october occasion the album so i thought i'd do a quick flip through for you so here we go hello i haven't been on my youtube channel for a long long time but i thought i'd do a quick flick through of my october occasionally album i am going to be putting charm on the side but the chain that i bought to make it with the um links are too small so i still have to make that so on the front um i used my silhouette to cut out some vinyl to do a pumpkin and the words and then going in here we are with my first page now for this album i've used the prima 31 collection which i had left over from last year and tracy reed's golden rod and october mood collections which are both digital collections which i've printed out so my basically introduction page and then we go over to this next spread so here i've cut out a coffee cup and just documented here um, my love for pumpkin spice um, but the fact that I don't actually like lattes I like Americanos so I buy uh, sugar-free pumpkin spice syrup and make Americanos with the sugar-free syrup here I just documented um, again I use my silhouette to make myself a t-shirt and um, that says some days I'm extra witchy because um, that's what the kids think I am they call me the witch in the kindest way um, this page here um, documents we went to visit my son and his wife um for my husband's but a little bit before my husband's birthday and he got his birthday present from my son there this one i cut out um the shape of a cat this um the cat was from tracy reed's digital collection and i enlarged it and then i've just put it on a um, an edging piece here so i could put it into the album to document the story about our new cat poppy who managed to eat raisins and cost us over 1100 pounds to get made better because raisins are very poisonous for cats on my husband's birthday, we went down to Margate to the Hornby Visitor Centre as he is a model railway enthusiast. And then we went to Reculver Towers, a nice little flip here. And him opening his presents, my daughter gave him a mole ornament for the garden and made him a mole birthday cake. This page here, we had some beautiful cobwebs in our garden during the um, autumn or October. And this is one of the photos of them. I cut out um, spider web here with my silhouette and then actually these are some papers. I don't know what they were, but they had uh, webs on which I cut out and just placed underneath. Went to a pumpkin festival um, at a nearby farm. Um, so I did a little flip here and did my journaling up the top there. And then I've got a couple of bits in the pocket here, a couple of photos. Um, that one on the back there, nothing on the back of that one. Just left those blank. Um, biggest news of October was the birth of Elodie Rose, my granddaughter, first of this generation, my husband and his wife and the baby just as they were born. Did a little shaker pocket here. Um, didn't have any um, small pockets for this album, so I actually um, made this one out of one um, pocket here and just fused it. I liked this idea that... Um, Oh, I think it was Dearly Dee did to do a spider's web. So I did that and then put all our decorations, photos of our decorations. And that was our fireplace. And then I always like to use one of the um, Instagram filters and for Halloween. And that, that's actually my profile photo through October. So I documented that there. A little different sized insert here and a little sort of book flip um detailing cuddles with elodie when she was a week old and uh, you are my pumpkin i thought was suitable my daughter doing our halloween baking all the treats stir the cauldron and then on the other side some more this said making magic from tracy reed's collection so i just put a b over the top so it's baking magic um on oh, the tiny these little tiny words strips i've got here they were from absolutely alice um on instagram so just some photos of the Halloween baking. My son sent me this wonderful photograph of Elodie in her first pumpkin, first Halloween outfit, cutest pumpkin in the patch. Loved that one. And then some photos of my daughter carving the pumpkin. She actually did two pumpkins. This was, I don't think I, no, I didn't document the first one. This was the larger of the two pumpkins. 
little again different shaped in sized insert and picture of the two of us wearing our halloween headbands and then halloween itself the um absolutely gorgeous um sweet treats she made us we had um ginger cupcakes we had rocky road and we had chocolate macadamia cookies which are absolutely delicious so detailed that on this tag here and then almost coming to the end there's penny my daughter wearing her halloween outfit which is a pumpkin onesie and then she's got these wonderful tights that she got from snag um a few bits of stickers and pieces on here and a picture of her with the pumpkin outside our house and then finishing off just a little recap of what october is meant to us so i can't get um the albums from citrus twist because it costs too much and i wanted to do um this size but i managed to get this one from craftelia so if you're in the uk and you want you don't want to spend out on the sh hugely expensive shipping from citrus twist um this is a, a, a quite a good option actually they're quite nice and they're only i think it was about 12 pounds so really good value for money anyway i hope you've enjoyed that flick through and I'll be back again. Hopefully I'm going to get back into recording videos. So I'll be back again soon. Bye for now.